<laughs> it, it, it was a almost like a master slave relationship. Like, um, you know, we coming to check on you every now and then. You know, um, you know, they always coming with tasers or you know beating him up or everything. It, it wasn't. It wasn't even just him. Like it was all of us. Like all my brothers. You know, um, not just my brothers. This neighborhood, uh, Slavic um, Village, Broadway, Harvard. Um, 131st, like all, um, this was like, <laughs> like the stuff you see on the movies, like kind of didn't, didn't compare to what we grew up in, you know, um, to Chief John Majoy, the Newburgh Heights Police Department had just started testing body cams when a camera captured the arrest of Deshaun Castleberry of Cleveland. Castleberry is the man who allegedly shot a Cleveland police officer over a month ago. Cruiser dash cam video captured police trying to stop Castleberry in a routine traffic stop back. Brother Sean, you know, he wasn't no angel, you know, at all times. Not None of us are, for real. Um, and he had his share of dirt and like, people will try to use that against him to justify this case, you know, just by giving him 25 years for some crazy stuff, you know, um, but his past was irrelevant to what happened at this point. It may have helped lead, lead to this Back on October 3rd, the officer clocked him at 60 miles per hour in a 25 mile hour zone, went to initiate a traffic stop, Mr. Castleberry. The, the incident in Newburgh, to, to continue on that, he, he, he seen the police um, getting behind it, he didn't want to be pulled over alone, so he tried to drive to my brother's house. But you know, they, they said he was running, it was only a couple streets, it was like two, three streets, and he pulled in my brother's driveway. So they would have some witnesses. Um, but you know, they say he was trying to run from him, he wasn't trying to run from him, he was trying to get in the spot with people. He eventually stopped and was handcuffed. He was arrested and placed in the he hasn't yeah, part of anything, you know, they, they publicly shamed my, my household, you know, um, like pe people actually use my brother to, to, for their campaign, you know, like, um, cats were trying to get elected using my brother's story, you know, and a lot of them were shamed, you know, not knowing the truth, like, the only thing that was being told was the other side, when they you pulled know, him over, they literally yoked him out the car and, you know, he, he, he's resisting, you know, they, you know, they tase him, do the dirt like usual. My brother says that they actually injected him with something, which isn't on the report. You know, they injected him with something, a uh, sedative or something, and then they pretty much gagged him and tied him up and uh, took him to jail. You know, um, they tried to use that incident to get favor for when the actual shooting happened. Cause this happened, what, um, like a week or two before, before the uh, shooting happened. I, I definitely think it was a uh, it was planned and plotted to either get my brother in jail or to actually provoke him to you know uh to get an incident where they could kill him. Uh police hated my brother. They they hated, they hated on They instantly put my nephew in uh handcuffs. My nephew he's thirteen years old, and they put him in handcuffs instantly. They throw him on the car. Um he's on the car with the guys who were sitting in the van with my brother. Um, Cause while my brother was sitting here, he was in the van with uh, three other guys. You know, they're sitting here, police didn't care. They actually shot the van up. They shot my neighbor's car up. Um, there was like a hole in the uh, garage. Time to broke open, time to broke open now. Broke open now. There go. But yeah, the neighbor had to get their um, car towed and fixed. Um, they just didn't have any regard for the, the people's lives, you know. Mm -hmm. Guys, they're out here literally in tears, like, you know, guys thought they were about to die, you know.